Here we go. Oh. Virgo, there's a focus on disappointments, people that done you wrong, situations that haven't been working out, um, difficult situations, but there's blessings in disguise. Um, it is important to keep moving forward. It's time to shut the door on this. It's time to leave these situations and upsets behind you. So that is very important. If you keep moving it on, it's like I see definitely new, it's either love, good friendships, blessings on your path ahead. So definitely it is important to kind of get rid of that kind of energy. So, um, or overall I'm seeing there's a fixed plan you have. It's almost like there's a systematic approach. Um, always have to dot the I's and cross the T's or this contract says dot, 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 dot. You know, sometimes rules are meant to be interpreted different or, bro or broken. There is no reason that you have to go on a fixed plan. So there's another message I see here. If you have many flat plans and you're fixated on them, well, the universe is gonna come and laugh at you because it's important to let go of this plan. You have to allow spontaneity in your life, good and bad, there's ups and downs. Be more spontaneous and allow for some growth. Sometimes we don't see the good. We focus just on the bad, you know, or oh, what's happening now. So it's important for Virgos to let go of any fixed plan, allow spontaneity and growth and go with the flow important message definitely some big endings are coming up changes redirections you have crossroads there is beautiful sunny energy there can be a celebration coming up it's bittersweet though there's a bittersweet tinge to things. So it's like from any disappointments comes blessings in disguise or, you know, we're just seeing that kind of energy. It's like the light is shed, but it's a beautiful sunny energy. I do see some celebrations and I do see it's a bittersweet energy as well. You have some important decisions to make, but don't base them on emotions or negativity, spite, you know, any kind of emotions because I do see here, you know, just allow these thoughts and overthinking things to bring you down. You definitely need a balance, a balance. Go more with the flow. You're holding back some kind of important decision. There could be something that's legal or a contract that you may be deciding to kind of change or um, make an important decision to eliminate something, okay? Watch your health and well-being this week. For some of you, there is a sep there are separations coming up or continuances or a time alone. Um, because destiny is at play here. So it's slowly eliminating what no longer serves you or not on the same path. Sometimes we think we are on the right path with the right people or whatever, and we're not. All right, this is a, a time with some of you maybe taking some time off, but there you need to get some rest and silently contemplate things because I am seeing here, you just need some time alone. If things slow down or you've been out of work or you've been like waiting for something, I want to say new opportunities are presenting themselves. I do see the energy of an Aquarius or the time of Aquarius. Those energies are showing up. But fate, um, destiny, something is destined here. So you have to go through some experiences, some, um, through uh, whatever is going on, redirections, good, bad, whatever it is, to get to where you're thinking um, or to clear the path for these new opportunities, okay? 
there is a wrap up coming up. Perseverance is important too with some with some things too. It's like you're a little bit cautious, but I see some dealing even with a little bit of jealousy maybe or envy around. But I do feel either some things that occurred in a few months ago may be coming to fruition somehow. For others, there's still a delay and it will it will make a year cycle. So say come March, April next year, something will be complete or a wish will be fulfilled then. But I do feel here a wish will come to fruition. This could be little sparks of miracles. I feel it's um, also spiritual intervention. Watch your emotions. You do have some support here. It's a good friend. I do feel that there is um, also... Um, your intuition could be guiding you. You got decisions to make and I do see here... Um, some kind of money addition to or new money may be coming in too, but may, you may have to wait for it. It could be an offer or something, but follow your intuition. It's important to allow and be spontaneous and allow growth. Very supportive energy here. There's somebody who's making some affirmations or some kind of prayers for you as well. You don't even know about it. That's all I can say here too, so that looks good. Okay. All right. Virgo. This is a reading for the week of September 12th through September 18th. For all Virgos who have a birthday this week, I want to wish you a very, very happy birthday and a blessed solar year ahead and beyond. 